Hi, my name is Chris Myers Ash, and I'm with the Capital Area New Mainers Project in Augusta. I'm here to help you learn how to find a job online. In this presentation, we will find a job on the website indeed.com. Indeed is a popular online platform that you can use to find a job online. So the first thing that we need to do is go to indeed.com. You can either go directly to the address www.indeed.com or you can just Google the word Indeed. I'll share my screen so that we can do this together. So here we are at Indeed.com. This is the Indeed homepage. At the top, you'll see two big boxes that ask you what and where. Go to the what box on the left side of your screen. This is where you type in what kind of job you are looking for. You may put in a job title or a keyword or a particular company. One easy way to start is to use a keyword to describe the kind of job you're looking for. For example, you could type in the industry or field that you have experience in. Let's try that first. In the what box, I'm going to type healthcare. In the where box, I will type the town where I want to find a job. In this case, my computer already knows that I'm in Augusta, but you could type any city into that box. Now, I will click on the blue button that says find jobs. Indeed will search for all the healthcare jobs within 25 miles of Augusta. You might wanna refine your search a little bit. You can do that by clicking on these gray boxes at the top. For example, let's say you're willing to drive more than 25 miles to get to work. Go to the box that says within 25 miles and click on the arrow. Go down to within 50 miles. Now it will show you all the healthcare jobs within 50 miles of Augusta. If you click on different gray boxes, you can see how you can filter the responses. For example, you may wanna find jobs that have been posted recently. So you click on the date posted box and search only the jobs that have been posted in the past week. So now you can see all the healthcare jobs within 50 miles of Augusta that have been posted in the past week. Let's look through some of them. The first one is for a scheduler at Maine Dartmouth Family Medical Residency in Augusta. Each box will tell you the job description, the employer, the city, and the amount of money that the job will play, along with some of the qualifications. When we click on the box for scheduler, we see the job description, qualifications, more details about the benefits and the schedule and other important information. If you want to apply for the job, you click on this big blue button that says apply now. You will have to open a free account with Indeed if you do want to apply for that job. Now, let's try a different way to find a job. Go back to the where button at the top. This time, instead of in typing in a particular industry, let's type in a company name. Maybe you heard that a particular company is a good company to work for and you want to work for that company. You would type that company's name into the what box. One company that has been welcoming immigrants for many years is L.L. Bean, one of the mo most famous companies in Maine. So we'll type L.L. Bean into the box and click find jobs. Now L.L. Bean is more than 50, 25 miles away from Augusta. So I will change the filter again to within 50 miles. As you can see, a big company like L.L. Bean will have many different jobs available. You can look closely at each one to see if it fits your needs. Again, it shows you the job title, the amount of money you'll be paid, the company, the city, sometimes the address. And if you click on the box, it will show you the job details. 
Indeed has thousands of jobs that are available in Maine. You can take some time to use different keywords to find the job that you're looking for. Think about the skills and job experiences that you have. If you speak another language, for example, that is a good keyword to type into the what box. For example, let's type the word Arabic into the box and click find jobs. Even within 25 miles of Augusta, there are several jobs that require Arabic language. And so if you have that particular skill, you can click on the job to find out more. There are many jobs available for people who speak Arabic. The same is true for other skills that you may have. If you are experienced in cooking, for example, you can type cook or chef into the box. If you are skilled in fixing cars, you can type auto mechanic into the box and you will see a long list of jobs that are available to people with that experience. Now remember, any job that you select first does not have to be your final job. It does not have to be the perfect job. It may fit your needs for now, but you can always change your mind later. You don't have to stay in the job forever. In America, we like to see jobs as stepping stones. Each job is a stepping stone to your next job. You build your experience, you develop your skills, and you meet people who can help you find your next better job. The most important thing is for you to work hard at whatever job you take. Develop a good relationship with your manager or your supervisor so that they can give you a recommendation if you wanna move on to a new job. If there's something you need at your job, feel free to ask for it. In this country, people expect you to be your own advocate. It's okay to ask. The more initiative that you show at work, the more your supervisor and your colleagues will respect you as a good worker. I hope you've enjoyed this presentation about how to find a job online. And I hope you find it useful in your job search. Good luck.